Man, oh man, I mess up. All right, so I thought it was fine just to play through some of the Blaze Loose Door with myself. And I'm thinking, ah, oh, it's fine. I don't need to show it. And so like for, for regular story, it's just a few different options. However, oh, the ending I just saw. So ending three, uh, first off, so ending one, if you remember, we fought with Ragna and Noel. That was a fun ending. I enjoyed that one. And then we just find the well peacefully sleeping. Now, ending three on the other hand, this thing has Hosma. Yeah, and turns out he picked up the crystal. So another thing too, it seems like each and every ending may actually just be another part of the total ending. So I'll need to go back through and record that. Though I won't be recording the individual options I'll definitely be recording like the last chapter. Like for chapter nine, for each of the different these things, I'll be recording those. Besides that, I'll be doing like one run through for each of the normal chapters. And oh gosh. if you guys haven't, you guys, if you're watching this content, you probably have seen a good number of endings, but if you haven't seen the blaze blue endings go blazing. They are wild. All right, but okay. So now that that's out of the way, hey YouTube, it's I, True Stuff, back at it again with another episode of Blaze Blue Cross Tide Battle. And this time. I will not be continuing on from Blaze Blue. There's still some clear rate that I need to complete, but I'll probably do that and add that on as a extra video, probably planned for like this Friday. I'll try to get all of them in one go and put it on like a nice little video that you can watch them quickly. So instead, I'll be playing through the Persona 4 Arena episodes. And this should be Pretty interesting since the original episode of Arena actually is like more or less directly after the base for some of the four games. And it's going to be interesting to see exactly how that plays into the story. Well, anyway, that's enough talking. Let's go ahead and jump into the gameplay. Gentlemen, thank you for your patience. Now, let us begin the 27th Keystone Scramble Tournament! What's that voice? Ow! Huh? Uh, you didn't write on my wallet! Yosuke? Oh, God! I felt this pain before! It's like my butt's gonna split in two! Hmm. Wait, Narukami? Why are you here? Actually, why am I here? Where are we? Calm down. I don't know either. I was at home just a minute ago. And I was on my way back from school. What the heck is going on? You don't think? Are we inside the TV? Are you serious? Well, I guess when freaky stuff happens, that's usually a pretty good guess. <sighs> yeah, it's a pretty good guess, but... Unfortunately, you're so wrong here. Though, so going back to the Hosma ending, we, well, another thing too we learned from the first ending is the fact that each different cast has their own crystal. So, that means you should be getting his own crystal. And the reason that is interesting is because the crystals seem like they all should be from blaze blue because they're alagar crystals and the fact that there's multiple other one for each franchise raises a lot of questions a lot of questions that we're just gonna have to see if they get answered i'm excited 
Now, back to the story. Oh, were we called here? Yosuke, you weren't in the electronics department at Juness, were you? No, man, I was just walking by a rice field. Not in class, not working. It was like the scenery in front of me suddenly disappeared. Before I knew it, I was here and my butt was in agony. So what about you? I'm not really getting the vibe that you went through your TV to get here. Yeah, I just came home from school. All of a sudden, here I am. And I have no idea why. I mean, there's no way we're inside the TV, right? I mean, I can't think of where else we'd be, but this is just too weird. Could Teddy be playing a trick on us? One way to find out. Hey, Teddy! If you're here, say something! I'll give you some cash if you come out! Huh? See? He's not here. If he were, he'd be flying over here with his hand outstretched. <laughs> so Teddy's not involved. Then how did we get here? Hold on. Why are you wearing your Yasugami uniform? Didn't you transfer? Or you, uh, go back to your original school, I guess? Yes, I was too used to it to notice. How did you not notice you were wearing a different uniform than everyone else? Are you sure you're not wearing it on purpose? No, seriously, I just got home from school. Well, that's weird. So if the Inaba mystery is solved, then you've gone back to the city. <laughs> uh... What well, a great way to explain why he has the clothes. Oh, why well, you have the clothes? I don't know, I just have them. Are you sure? Are you crazy? No, I, I just got home. I, I don't know why. Hmm. What brought the two of us here? I don't know. At least there aren't any signs of shadows. For now? But we better not let our guard down. We're strangers in a strange land, and that can't be. Ugh. I hate to interrupt your dramatic reunion, but excuse me. Well, yeah, what's that? It's that voice again. Ah, the fiery bloom of friendship, the surging hormones of adolescence. It really takes me back. Who are you? Damn it, where is it coming from? Given how weird this place is, do you think it's somebody's shadow? Okay, you're really starting to piss me off. Stop talking about adolescence and start giving us answers. Okie doke. Allow me to explain the rules of the Keystone Scramble Tournament, which you are now taking part in. I wonder, are we gonna have a different number this time? Well, we had like, what, 35 and 100 and something last time. What's she gonna say this time? 58? What? When did we sign up for that? The rules are simple. All you need to do is take the keystone given to you and make for the goal. Oh, so no number. Uh, something about this just feels wrong. But if your item is taken away from you, you'll be disqualified. Which will result in you being stuck in this world for eternity. Good luck! Wait, 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 wait. Don't just gloss over something so important. Nah, it's insignificant. If you manage to keep your keystone safe and make it to the goal, then everyone will be freed! Yay! Goal? Where is this goal? Everyone? But if you do get disqualified, painful and embarrassing repercussions, or should I say punishments, await. Oh, Those should be fun. Punishments? Okay, painful I get, but do they have to be embarrassing? Oh my what are they gonna do to us? Let's <laughs> get the whole the thing The stones will be distributed to the leader of each team. The leader must rely on their buddies to keep it safe and beat up any pests blocking their way. So each team has a keystone. You know, when you stay so calm at times like these, it really makes me look stupid. I mean, it doesn't well, make you look... more importantly, what are you holding? I didn't realize I was holding anything, but this must be a keystone. Yeah, so like I said, like in the last 
last little like <clears throat> group of episodes, a little playlist. It seems that each of the different franchises has their own color attached to it. And Crystone is yellow, Blaze Blue is blue, etc. And this is really interesting when we also consider the fact that each one of these shards corresponds to the color. And another interesting thing is just how the actual introductions of the different franchises also use like similar shards with similar colors. I think that's a nice little touch by the design team. Just have everything interconnected, even if they don't really need to be. You are correct. That is the keystone you must protect. Now, Team Yellow, tell me, how excited are you? Slow down. What exactly is this stone? And why teams? You said everyone earlier. Does that mean Yosuke and I aren't the only ones here? I spy with my little eye an enemy your foe's looking to take your keystone and he's Ooh. got murder in his eyes you better hit him with everything you've got Who's it gonna be it's like she's not listening to a word we're saying and man she's been saying a lot of disturbing stuff huh hold on karma this has got to be the guy she was talking about the enemy man he's really staring us down and he does not look happy he's serious about this guess he doesn't want to face that embarrassing punishment now this is interesting because when we saw the last episode carmine was with hockeyman and they seem pretty fresh but if we go by what's happening in this episode, they would have already been beaten up. I mean, I also have another question too, just the fact that for the Ruby episodes, Ruby should be the leader. So if she was going around looking for a crystal, I somehow doubt that's gonna that's gonna cross into like the Blaze Blue one. Because that doesn't make sense. Or maybe it does. There's so much we don't know. So much you get to find out. Neither do I. Wait, that's what you're getting from this? Do you two ever stop yapping? Seems like you need me to rip your tongues out. All right, who's this partner, though? Uh, how do I even answer that? <laughs> hey, Narukami, what did we do? Look, I'm sorry if we offended you, but we really don't want to fight. We just want to know what's going on here. Shut up! You can fight me and die, or hand the rock over and die. Take your pick. Man, does nobody listen around here? This is nope. not looking good, dude. Think we should get out of here? Or... I don't think this guy's about to let us go. Which means... Yosuke, if we're inside the TV... Yeah, let's give it a shot. Izanagi! Jiraiya! Oh, it worked! It really worked! Damn, this place is weird. <sighs> <laughs> Guess you guys have some crazy in you, too. Good. I was worried this was gonna be boring. Yikes, he's really getting worked up now. Still, he's just a normal human, right? Is it really okay for us to use our personas? Our goal is to stop him, not hurt him. We just have to take it easy. Take it easy, you say? <laughs> Aren't you precious? I can't wait to carve up that uppity face of yours. You hear that? These two are mine. Don't you dare get in my way. Who is it, wizard? Oh. Give me a break. Just let me have a bite, Carmine Prime. Don't need to be so greedy. Says the greedy harvester. Don't be a hypocrite. Mm. Okay, now we have two nut jobs to deal with. Do we still have to take it easy? I mean, they are after that thing you're holding, right? So, which one of us goes first? Not that I'd mind crushing them both myself. Who the hell said we were taking turns? These punks are all mine! 
Tag team entries approved. With that, we can enter battle mode. Best of luck to both teams. <sighs> approved? What did you just approve us for? <laughs> to fight. <laughs> so that's how it works. Looks like you and me are a tag team now. The hell? No one ever told me about this. Yosuke, let's just get through this. We need to keep this keystone safe no matter what. Fine. If we've got it, we've got it. Never thought we'd get to fight together again, though. Let's do this, partner. Yeah. Now that really is interesting. Because Gordo is at least showing the Get same ready. level of interest Get that he ready. showed in the Blade Blue storyline. And since this was, I mean, if you go at chapter, this was a chapter before he met Ragna. Can't escape from crossing fate. I don't know how much that actually means, but. Counter. Gotcha. Alright. You know what? That's not. You Alright. Now we can just start the game Oh, that was a mistake. Oh well. Okay, let's. I did not need to switch out quickly. Barely. Oh wait. Let's go ahead and see right here. Just start zooming. Nice clean fight with some of the now, best person in the game. Right, later guys. Damn it! Get back here, you bastards! Whew. We managed to get away. The chapter is still close. going on. Are we seriously going to have guys like that coming after us all the time? I don't know, but if what that voice was saying earlier is true. Our troubles are far from over. Let's just try to avoid combat as much as possible from now on. Hmm. Yeah, if we fight everyone we run into, we're not gonna last long. Where's this goal supposed to be anyway? Not a clue. If only Teddy were here to shed some light on this for us. <laughs> only well, here. it sounds like this goal is some kind of exit. One way or another, we gotta find it. What we talk that matter? Let's just keep moving forward. I'm always up for a wander. Lead on, buddy. All right, so I'm guessing that's probably the end of this chapter. So we're going to call this episode here. Yep. Uh, you don't think those guys from earlier are chasing us, do you? Yeah. We're going to go ahead and call the first episode of episode Persona 4 Arena here. And we'll continue with the next episode tomorrow. This episode was not as in it straightforward and entertaining as the Blaze Blue one. Kind of felt a lot more forced and just a way to get into action. But the amount of questions it raised uh, made, it a, made it fairly acceptable. Though, how exactly a lot of these questions are going to get answered is anyone's guess well until next time i'll see all you guys in the next episode